Hey everybody, this is Jay Nondes, the Antonio Metal Music Examiner here at Backstage Live on Friday the 13th of April. And we are here with the guitarist from Legacy of Disorder, Mr. Ron Afraylik. How are you? Hey, good. Hey, they just got off stage opening here for Guar here at Backstage Live, and it's a fantastic opportunity to talk to other guys here. Welcome to San Antonio, first of all. Yeah, cheers. You just got off stage. How did it feel? I felt good. I felt good. I felt good on stage. The, yeah. crowd, the crowd was a bit hard. They were looking better. We just do what we do. Yeah. Keeps it true. Now, one thing that always fascinates me with bands is besides, you know, when the members are from different places, besides the eclectic mix of your musical influences, it, it always interests me, you know, how band members hook up from different parts of the world. Now, you guys, you are from New Zealand, especially yes. you. Yeah. I know Matt Thompson, your drummer, is from Dallas, Texas, right? Correct. Where is James Robinson, your singer, from? Um, I come from the... Um, the South Island of New Zealand, the top okay. of the South. And um, him and Jace, a bass player, both come from the North. Okay. And uh, me and Jace met, must be nine years ago now, and we played in the band down in the South Island. And we couldn't find the musicians, so we moved up North, and it took about two years to find Jace on the vocals. Mm -hmm. And we had, a, we had a drummer there for a while, and it wasn't really gelling. There's a lot of um, in the intricacy of the, um, the double kick and that here, it wasn't really pulling off the sort of band we are. So, um, unfortunately for him, we went to Dallas to record the Sterling, we recorded the later Pantera stuff, we met Matt. So Matt has been with us ever since, and this is the lineup. so, yeah. yeah. It's like everyone can count on each other, you know what I mean? <laughs> well, did you guys get a chance at all to explore San Antonio today, or did you just come in and do no, some no. check? We, we had the long drive from yesterday, and um, pretty much just parked up. I had another interview a little bit earlier on. Uh, Relaxed. Um, it was a bit of a few problems with the sound check today, but it worked out. I have been here before. Oh, tell, tell me about your last visit here. I came here, um, we were doing um, promotional shows, but um, now we're allowed to play everywhere. You can't be them at all. And um, uh, we were recording up here and doing promotional shows. And, you know, shows. Uh, we went down to um, Austin. To, to check it out. Yeah. We, I'm a bit of a Cowboy Western fan. And so we drove down here to the other boat. Right. What'd you think of it? Well, um... Are you a history buff? Or yeah, I'm a history buff. Yeah, I'm a history buff. Yeah, I'm a history buff. Yeah, yeah there was the line in that where Jim Bowie was killed and whatnot. Whether or not it's exactly accurate, I don't know, but... <laughs> <laughs> I like that sort of stuff. Yeah, well... An interesting thing is, no matter where you're watching this from, or whatever city you are in, but especially if you're watching this from San Antonio, go out and check Legacy of Disorder on tour. I highly recommend it. But if you happen to miss, tonight is the first night on the second leg of the tour with Guar. Yeah. But if you happen to miss them tonight and you're from San Antonio, they come back here in 18 days. Legacy of Disorder will be right back here at Backstage Live, kicking off the Fear Factory Shadows Fall Tour. Yeah. So, I mean, that, that's, that's kind of a weird, uh, but strange, I mean, it's our game here in San Antonio Thank you. that you guys are going to be back here again. Does it feel a little weird that you're going to be no. hooking off that one tour and no, coming we, right back? we're going to be doing it uh, again and again and again. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, this tour here, we're going to be, with the two tours combined, we're going to be, um, 53 shows in 62 days. Wow. That's a horrendous schedule. Wow, how are you guys going to be able to hold up? But the core tour is, uh, 35 days and, um, 35 gigs in 40 days. So this this war tour has been very good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it's been really cool. Just gonna look after yourself and fuck around everyone, you know? I'm pretty bored out kind of. I think that's what we're doing for. Well, as you can hear in the background, some of the other bands that are opening for Guar after Legacy of Disorder are playing, but this is their second and latest CD. It's called Last Man Standing. Um, I highly recommend it. Go check it out. Uh, like I said, you have two albums out, but yeah. you just got done playing a 30-minute set, and I believe every single song you just played is off of this CD. Yeah, it is. Um, this here, we're just trying to get distribution to here in the States for that moment. But um, the, the debut album, the self-titled Legacy of Disorder, you get on iTunes, CD Baby. But once we go and get a distribution deal done, you'll be able to buy it. But up until then, you can only buy many shows. And, and I believe... For, for Last Man Standing, it was recorded in separate places, in New Zealand and Dallas, is that correct? Yeah, right? we did the drums in uh, Dallas, Texas, in No Man Studios, and we did uh, the rest of us in Wellington, Sterling all over. So it was really cool, wow. it was done on our own terms, and we're absolutely wrapped about the progression from 
for yourself to seek the album. Was, that a, was there a different process with the recording and the writing from the first album? Oh, no, I believe so. We just got more comfortable with who we were recording with. And I believe that we cut off a lot of the, a lot of the fat. It gets to the hooks a lot quicker on the, on the, on the, on the new album, Last Me Steaming. Yeah. Even though I'm very, very proud of the first album. <laughs> you know? Yeah. I, I think a band should get better as they go. So, I mean, be honest with me here. I mean, are you, are you big war fans, Spirit Factory, Shadow Small fans? Is this one tour, do you think, going to feel differently than the other for you guys? Or Absolutely. Is well, we've been treated really, really well on this tour. Um, the tour has actually been really well looked after. Uh, and it's, I think um, the other bands have pretty good gel with us, more lives, like us. The tour manager likes us, he's touring he managing us. That always helps, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, um, I think it'll be slightly different. We just have to carry on doing what we're doing. You know, I, I don't have to worry too much about what this person is doing or that person is doing or what this band is doing or that person is doing. I'm all about legacy. So, well, what do you think of America and San Antonio in particular? I mean, are, are anything oh, it's the cool, There's so much history here. I mean, I'd love to have some time to check it out. As I say, when I was here last, we actually came down here just to check out San Antonio. We're playing here, isn't we? We've thrown Parra de Fara from Dallas. Right. Right. Well, about four and a half hours, I think, yeah. from Dallas, yeah. Yeah, a lot of history in Texas. Pretty cool place. It's pretty, pretty crazy. I grew up loving all the Cowboy Weeks and stuff, the Jim Bowie, the, you know, the Sam Schuster, the, you know, the whole, you know, there's some pretty cool things going on. Yeah. Hey, you know, you know, <laughs> it's, it's the way it is. Well, if you, if you didn't happen to notice, the guy walking by really fast was uh, Order Sarungus uh, out of costume, and I will be talking to him shortly. But for now, thank you very much, Ronald Fraley. Thank Legacy you. of Disorder, thank you so much for taking the time. Best of luck with the album and the tour. And like we said, catch him in a city uh, that's coming by near you in the next uh, month or so. And if you're watching this in San Antonio, they will be back right here at Backstage Live on Tuesday, May 1st, with Fear Factory and Shadows Fall. So for Ronald, this is Jay Nott of San Antonio, Metal Music Examiner. We'll see you next time. Thank you.